hell is wrong with you back there? What? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on, no, no, come on, that's ridiculous. What the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... This can't all be happening. Maybe like one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's gotta be something going on here. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Did you see the gold? Anything? Manchurian gold isn't actually gold. It's a fucking chemical and it's leaking all over cargo hold too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this isn't exactly what our friendly fishermen are expecting either. <sighs> this should go over well. What do you think actually happened to this place? Wish I knew. I saw 1947 on the newspaper. There was a note about a storm in the logbook. I guess they got caught in it. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, weird. And I don't like it. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big floating coffin. So where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. We gotta get off this damn ship. No shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. if they weren't Swiss cheesed. Find a way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Huh. A 
must have been moving some pretty dangerous cargo. Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. I'll pull you up. Over here! Gotta wait through here. Find a radio yet? No, but there's gotta be a radio on this ship. There there has to be. Not exactly confident about our chances of surviving this point. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Yeah, that's gross. Looks like this poor sucker bit it right in the middle of his message. Sounds pretty desperate. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? 
Look, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working! It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey! Hey! Is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Over. Holy shit! We got him! Uh... If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees, 30 minutes south, 151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please, get here now. We need help. This is an emergency. Please, help. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please, come in. Hey, come here, look. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the pitcher's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? I got... I got this. I'm not losing you to this fucking ship. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this. Trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. All right, you and me, Julia. Broken bones. Everything still work? You guys all right down there? I'm okay. You see anything? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. O okay. We'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. After you. Looks like we're in the lower levels of the ship. Someone named Joe was in the sick bay.
So it looks like there was some sort of fight and this Charlie went to the brig. Ten day sentence. Must have been a big fight. hundred hot baths if we ever get out of here. We're gonna get out of here, Julia. I hope you're right. Am I ever wrong? Son of someone on board. Take a look. Look, down there. I think that's the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Let's find out. Shit. No more ladder. I can drop the rest of the way. Wait. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Come on down. What's up? Uh, you didn't fucking see that? Ray, no. Of course you didn't. Um, hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seen clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. So, the ship was carrying Manchurian gold. But that was really some sort of hallucinogenic bioweapon developed in China during World War II. We know it was unstable and leaked all over the ship. Maybe it's still here, and it's having the same effect on us. Paranoia, hallucinations, that was what this stuff was designed to do. The crew was hallucinating. We know they were scared of something, and the officers thought it was just a bunch of jumpy GIs trying to get out of guard duty. All this crazy shit going on, none of it's real. None of it's actually there. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I don't know, it seems like the plane came in contact with the ship, but it's just a theory. Oh God. All right, let's get going. You ever wonder what would have happened if we went to Japan on vacation instead? Shut up.
What do you think? I don't like it. Someone attacked that corpse recently. Too recently. We need to keep moving and stay ahead of whoever did that. We're just wasting time. Let's go. brought it from the Duke. You think it still works? Uh, it's got maybe a few minutes of air left. Worth taking with us? It's just gonna slow us down. No. We should take it. Parts of the ship are completely underwater. No use hiding, you little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deal? You can't have all the gold. again. We're good. We're, we're now. No, no, not 
like that. I said, no changing. Just put the gun down. Nobody has to get hurt. You think I wanted to hurt anybody? I didn't get a choice in this, did I? It's in you too, isn't it? Isn't it now? Ha! Not again! It's all good changing on me! What? What's changing? Stay away! Stay back from the mist! Hey! There's no mist, man! Don't breathe it! Don't breathe the mist! Wait, what is this mist? What does it do? It's life. Bringing things to life that shouldn't be alive. It's inside now. Inside with us now. Please just calm down. Stop! Stop! It's in one of us, isn't it? Put the gun down, now. Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you breathed in the mist. It's happening. I can feel it. Okay. Look, there was something in the last room. A, a, a fog or a mist, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? Sure. I mean, we all did a little. Oh. Ah! No! 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 This way, I guess. Oh, come on! Just like that fucking movie with the ship and the, the water. I'm way less dancing. God damn it. Don't I get a stunt double at least? Well, this is just riveting. down there and make sure everything's okay. Shit. Well, what's our play? I'll find them. Make sure they're okay. You stay here with the radio. There has to be a better idea. I'm gonna stay as far away from trouble as I can, and I'll be back as soon as I find the generator. It'll... it'll be fine. Just keep your head down, okay?
swear to God, if I make it through this, I'll never even set foot on a paddle boat again.
All right, let's try it. Maybe I could have done something. Maybe it could have been me. Who else it should have been? So out of nowhere, this thing just sent out an SOS. Guess we got a real life ghost ship here. Whoa, what the hell is this? That's it, game over. You're done, for now at least. You could always try again, see if you can't do better next time around. Not a very happy ending, or maybe it is. Depends what makes you happy, really. I suppose when the curtain falls, you're either ready for it or you're not. 
It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. Till we meet again, maybe in Little Hope, maybe somewhere else. But be certain, we will meet again. It's inevitable. <laughs> <laughs>